Yeah man, my name is Levi Pro and today I'm going to show you how to play Jehovah is your name in the key of F sharp. I know all, all most of you or almost everyone or some of you you've been playing it in a basic mode or even advanced but you can't get the dynamics of maybe the original song how it goes. But today I've come to show you those tricks, those simple easy small things that will transform how you play. So please watch till the end and learn a lot about this song Jehovah is your name and the chords that I'm going to be using. So yes, let's begin. Yeah, so in the key of F sharp, as you can see the transpose is zero. So yeah, we have to transform how we sound from basic to advanced, okay? Yeah, so I'm going to play then show you how to do it. finishing so yes so it's easy um we begin with uh, f sharp this is first inversion then you just double the third okay then we go so here is a minor chord this is a minor minor because you're playing one but this is g sharp minor okay g sharp minor seven because you're playing one the minor third has an octave on the right then the fifth, okay. So I'm gonna grace in to the to the uh, then the fifth, then the seven, okay. So I'm gonna grace in to the seven, okay, like that. Yes, like that. Then this is uh, F sharp nine, okay. Because I'm playing the uh, 5, 1, 9, and the 5, okay? Then the third, 1, and the 9, on the left. So from the top, Jehovah, don't mind about my vocals, okay? Yes, then you go to the fourth, do this. When you do it faster, then you play the fourth. This is the fourth, okay. Mm -hmm. This is the with the dominant seven. This is the dominant seven. Then on the on the left, uh, you do the three major third of the B and the dominants and, and the and the mm -hmm. this is uh, and the five, yes. Then you do this work. just the fourth but just walking and now the fifth uh, first inversion because this root first okay sorry then. okay yes so these are fourth basically a fourth so Okay, this you can even call it a diminished, okay? A diminished, uh, C sharp diminished. This is how you hold it, okay? Well, now, these five, you play it on the bass, and then these that, you play it on the bass, like this. So, then, the dominant fifth okay yes mm -hmm. this is second inversion okay root first second inversion so if you play the dominant seven that's how it's gonna be but for the sake of the voicing uh, these uh, root note I'm playing it on my left yes so 
I do this work. Let me repeat again. Then you do this work. Mm -hmm. These are four, five, one movement. What are six, seven, one? Yep, yep. Okay, my cameraman, maybe you can lift the camera up. Yes, yeah, like that. You do this. Okay, just playing with the nine. This is four with the nine. Because as you can see, I'm playing the third. Okay. I'm playing the third on the left. Then I'm playing the root note. Okay. And then the nine. Okay. This is what we call um rootless voicing because that's a fourth. Then you do this two re do re 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 but faster. The same because this this is the fifth, okay? There's a that so the fifth C sharp, okay, major. So the third on the left, uh, then um, the root note, then the nine, the up. So when you do this. In. This is F sharp nine nine F sharp nine sorry F sharp nine voice like this um, five one nine five then on the left three one nine okay is a minor chord. Seven. This is G sharp. Then we have the minor third here. Uh, then we have the sharp sharp five. The dominant and the third minor third. This is uh, F sharp do with the dominant seven because we have one five one. When you have the the, the three major third. The dom uh, the dominant seven, yeah, and then the one and the third. Instead of playing it like this, voice it like this. So, then go to the fourth, the nine. This is simply a diminished chord, uh, G diminished, okay? Play it like this. If you want to find a diminished chord of any key, you first play the minor chord. In this case, G minor. Then you flatten the fifth. Then if you want it to be diminished seven, you can play the six, which is E. So you add it to be a diminished seven, okay? So this case, in this case, I'm going to voice it like this. Like this. So this is one, third, then the the seventh in this case are diminished seven then um on the left i'm gonna play uh e flat then i'm gonna play the third and now the fifth at uh, the flat fifth okay yes okay so A minor seven G sharp minor seven because one one five seven then the third minor third then the seven again the root note then still on the same chord okay just uh, you play that on the left you play the the fifth and then uh, the dominant seven 
and then the nine and then this is what the fifth yes. okay now i've not played whether it's a major or minor but in music there are no rules sometimes you break the rules as long as, as, long as you're sounding cor cor uh, correct yep so around yes then you finish like this so if you need more of this lesson you can just inbox me via whatsapp uh, if you need clarification and you can get even other lessons at an affordable prices well explained clearly and everything so subscribe to this video and then Share to as many people as possible and like so that it can be recommended to a wider audience so that you can learn together. So peace, peace. Let's subscribe. Thank you.